Good morning. Today is Tuesday, September 14th, 2021. Please join me and stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. You may be seated. Happy birthday today to Haley Olson. I hope you have a great birthday today, Haley. For lunch today, we'll have soft shell chicken tacos, romaine lettuce, cheddar cheese, savory refried beans, mixed fruit, and milk. Tomorrow for breakfast, we'll have a cherry frutal, applesauce cup, orange juice, and milk. Our junior high is starting a speech club. This is an IESA speech contest club. IESA is the state organization for middle school sports and activities. In speech club, students will practice a speech by themselves, with a partner, or in a group. The performance can be funny or serious. You can choose one already made up or make up your own poem. We will meet, be meeting mostly at lunchtime, so it won't interfere with other after-school activities or sports. Then, in the end of October and beginning of November, we will travel to other schools or have kids from other schools come here and start having competitions. Speakers will be competing for a score based on a rubric and not really competing against each other. Speakers will receive awards based on their performances. If you come to the lunch meeting today in the health room, Mrs. Stone will show some more examples of performances on YouTube. Then you can decide if you want to be a part of the program. So to find out more about this fun activity, please bring your lunch and go to Health Room D200 on Tuesday, September 14th, which is today. I want to give a shout out today. I had some of our lunchroom workers stop by and tell me that they wanted to give a big kudos of congratulations to Easton Odom. Easton has been doing a great job every day. He's been helping pick up area around him and picking up things that don't even belong to him. So Easton, we're very proud of you. I'm going to have you come to my office later today and we'll have a little reward for your extra efforts helping keep our lunchroom clean. Thank you, Easton, for all you do. I think it's about time for us to have another gift card try. So uh, we have a gift card for $10 to Amazon. And anyone who emails me the correct answer by tomorrow, by actually by tonight at five o'clock, um, will be in the drawing for a $10 Amazon gift card. On this date, September 14th in 1814, Francis Scott Key writes the Star Spangled Banner. Francis Scott Key actually writes a poem, which is later set to music and in 1931 becomes the national anthem. The Star Spangled Banner was written after Key witnessed <clears throat> the Maryland fort being bomb bombarded by the British during the War of 1812. Key was inspired by the sight of the lone U.S. flag still flying over the fort at daybreak as he reflected on the now famous words of the Star Spangled Banner. And the rocket's red glare, the bombs bursting in air, gave proof through the night that our flag was still there. So, obviously it's a big day in our history. So the, today's quiz question or trivia question is, when Francis Scott Key originally wrote the poem, it had a different title. Anyone who can find out what the different title was of Francis Scott Key's poem that would later become the Star Spangled Banner will be put in the drawing for a $10 Amazon gift card. Good luck on your research. That's all the announcements we have for today, but let's remember our Morris motto to be respectful, be responsible, and be safe. Have a great day, and go Lady Braves. Let's win a regional championship tonight.